Uh, then there's Taylor Swift. Uh, Beijing's rift now is continuing with the pop culture icon uh, from Chinese fans right now. The singer is going to perform in Shanghai next month, but I guess it's ruffled some feathers thinking, wait a minute, what are you even doing here, right? Are you asking me? Well, I want to say something first of all about China. And well, I was going to ask Dan. You're going to ask. I don't think he knows. Who, right? Who's too like Taylor Swift? If you ask the lady about Taylor Swift. Well, I think Taylor Swift, much like uh, the trade deal, is going to go from bad blood to shake it off to bad blood, Whoa. and that's in the relationship with China. Whoa. And we're in the shake it off she, phase she when negotiating yeah, the she trade did. deal. Very good. You didn't know for any of that. Uh, uh, and so we're in the shake it off phase with the China trade okay. deal. We're going to be back to where we started. Trump is going to have made sound and fury all signifying nothing, while while uh, people that make automobiles in Ohio and, and soybean farmers in Iowa are the ones that are going to have to suffer, not to mention the volatility in the stock market. It, it sounds like you're not a fan of the president. I'm just taking that leap. Um, Rob, well, his uh, policy. I see. Rob, what do you so think? So about this Taylor Swift thing, it's um, entertainer hypocrisy all over again. You know, Taylor Swift is supposedly now this big activist out of stay, after staying out of politics for a really long time. Um, she made that video, You Need to Calm Down, where all Trump supporters were... Uh, toothless rubes that were against, you know, everybody that was not uh, white or Christian or whatever in the country. But now, faced with... Uh, I forgot uh, about that. Yeah, yeah, she yeah, did that. Yeah. And so that was her entry in, that, uh, in the activism. So now I'm faced with a place that actual has human rights violations, um, that is actually interning people, all the other stuff. She's still going to go there and take the paycheck. It's just like the NBA woke warriors that we have that are so ready to um, bash America, but as soon as when something comes to China and when their paycheck is at play, they shut up Wasn't a Wasn't this arranged a long time ago, though? I'm not What's sure. that? It was arranged a long time ago, ago, but if she truly wanted to be woke, she could have walked away from it. Yeah. She turns out a lot of people to vote. She does a lot of voter right. engagement. She's got a lot of talent. And in fact, she changed the entire industry with online streaming and got a lot of artists a lot more money because of the way she was able to use leverage. Now we but see. Didn't someone buy her stuff? Though? Yeah. So she lost a lot of money. They did. And she that lost doesn't a lot make her not a hypocrite either. Well, I mean, I, I love how everybody's favorite person is to bash Taylor Swift, but the reality right. no, is I that like American the companies she are, is no are dependent Adele, on China. She is no young lady. Well, that I, woman I, I, has a voice from heaven. Or Beyonce. Uh, yeah, well, there we go. Fair enough. <laughs>